What's the difference between an appraisal and a home inspection? Great question, Tracy. So an appraisal is something that happens after a home goes under contract. So buyer says, okay, I want to buy this home. I'm going to pay this much money for it and I'm going to go get a loan. So the bank hires an appraiser to come out and look at the property and compare it to other homes that have sold, right? That's usually the sold, compa compa looking compa backward. Yeah. The comparison method, they look backward and see, okay, what have homes sold for? Okay. Is the bank making a good investment by loaning this person this much money for this property? So it's not so, really, a, that, that's the people always get mixed up is it doesn't establish value. It justifies the value that the buyer is willing to pay to the bank. Right. So we're basically the appraiser is being the eyes and ears of the bank who doesn't go out to the house to make sure, yes, this is a house that's of the quality that we want to lend this much money on. Right. So the appraiser is really just making sure for the bank that they're making a good loan. Well, something that happens that confuses people a lot, a lot of times you'll hear lenders or people in the lending side of the, the, the business say, yes, the appraisal inspection is on Tuesday. Well, they call it an inspection, but it's not the true like home inspection, which I'm going to ask you about in a second. It means that the appraiser's coming out, they're going to look at the home. Now they are checking that you know the, the basics are there right you've got hot and cold running water you've got heat a stove and, you've got a stove you, you don't know, have to have cooling it's got a roof that doesn't you know not falling in they, they want to make sure that the general condition of the home is good it doesn't have to be perfect but different lending standards have different things so like a va loan is much more strict on the condition of the property than let's say a conventional loan so that that's the appraiser part so tracy what is a inspection in the in the sense that we talk about it a home inspection right so home inspection is an inspector who comes in and turns on every faucet turns on the um checks all the electrical outlets open and closes windows checks the roof checks the foundation kind of walks from room to room and checks everything from nuts to bolts right from roof to foundation to drainage and and they provide a written report but that's you know very different than what an appraiser does an appraiser doesn't check everything to make sure it works they just have a few bullet points so when you get a full let me ask this because i've heard this before this term when you get a full home inspection is there like a pass fail <laughs> there is not yes there is no pass fail so once you get the home inspection uh, typically in our market, you have the opportunity to ask the seller to make some repairs. And that's your second negotiation, right? The first negotiation is getting the house under contract. Right. The second negotiation might be repairs. And typically it's um, mechanical, structural, danger, safety kind of things. Warrantable is yeah. a word I use a lot. It's like, you know, is it something in the home that can be warrantable? And those are the type of things that, that a, a buyer may ask a seller to fix. Now in this market, you know, you, you may have to to waive that to get the home because it's so competitive. There's buyers out there willing to waive doing any inspection or excuse doing me, doing any repairs, doing any, asking for any, for any repairs. So right. They may be willing to take them on themselves. They might be w willing to get their offer accepted, waive any repair requests down the road. And, and I want to make a caveat to that is I would never, ever recommend that somebody get a um, or waive a home inspection. You can always get the home inspection. It's part of our contracts. You never want to say, well, you know, I want to get the home, so I'm going to waive home inspections. No, get the home inspections. Just make it clear that you're not going to be nitpicky about the repairs if you're comfortable about it, if you want to be competitive. You know, there's a lot of really handy people out there. And you know, when we work with them and they say, oh, I can fix anything, I can fix that, or I have the money if something comes up on the home inspection, I can take care of it. But then there are people who don't. They're, every penny they have, they're going to be putting in their down payment and getting in that house. And for them, you know, getting a home warranty on top of their purchase or, you know, having the ability to ask for the repairs for the major things can be pretty important.